Welcome back to Wealth Minds Elite, the place where we redefine success, one elite mind at a time. Today, we're diving into 15 good habits that can drastically change your life. We're not talking about getting rich quick schemes. This is about building a solid foundation for success and fulfillment. You know, the kind of stuff that actually makes you a well-rounded, interesting person. Think of it like this. Your life is a real estate investment. You wouldn't just buy any old shack and call it a day, right? You'd want to invest in something with good bones, solid structure, and the potential for appreciation. These 15 habits are like renovations for your life, upgrading your daily routine and setting you up for massive long-term gains. Ready to transform your daily routine and accelerate your journey to wealth. We'll be covering everything from waking up early to practicing gratitude, because let's face it, a little bit of thankfulness can go a long way, especially when you're crushing your financial goals. So buckle up, grab your notebooks, and get ready to level up your life. Let's get started. All right, elite minds, let's talk about waking up early. I know, I know, hitting that snooze button is tempting, but trust me, those extra few hours in the morning are pure gold. Think about it. The world is still quiet, your phone isn't blowing up with notifications, and you can actually hear yourself think. Waking up early gives you a chance to start your day on your own terms. You can ease into your morning routine, enjoy a cup of coffee while the sun rises, and actually get stuff done before the chaos of the day begins. Plus, studies show that early birds tend to be more productive, proactive, and even make more money. And who doesn't want that? Now, I'm not saying you need to become some kind of superhuman who wakes up at 4 a.m. every day. Start small. Try setting your alarm just 15 minutes earlier and gradually increase it over time. You'll be surprised how much of a difference it makes. Remember, the early bird might get the worm, but the early entrepreneur gets the whole dang farm. So set that alarm and let's conquer the day. And hey, if you enjoyed this tip, why not subscribe to our channel? I promise, we won't wake you up at 4 a.m. Let's talk about gratitude. No, I'm not telling you to hug trees or thank your toaster oven. Appreciating the good things can impact your well-being, including your financial well-being. Focusing on lack creates negativity. Shift to gratitude and see the abundance. Write down three things you're grateful for each morning. It could be a good cup of coffee or a sunny day. Gratitude can go a long way, especially in building wealth. All right, let's talk about exercise. I know, I know, sometimes the only running we want to do is to the fridge for another snack. But trust me on this one, guys. Think of your body like your financial portfolio. You've got to invest in it to see those sweet, sweet returns. And no, I'm not talking about six-pack abs. Though, hey, if that's your goal, go for it. I'm talking about feeling good, having energy, and being able to enjoy life to the fullest. Even a little bit of exercise each day can make a huge difference. A brisk walk, some push-ups, maybe a yoga class, whatever floats your boat. The key is consistency. Just like building wealth, it's about those small, consistent actions over time that really add up. So ditch the excuses and get moving. Your future self will thank you for it. And hey, if you can afford a personal trainer and a fancy gym membership, more power to you. But even if you're on a budget, there are tons of free workout videos online. No excuses. We're all about setting goals here, right? But sometimes those big, hairy, audacious goals can feel, well, a little overwhelming. That's where daily goals come in. Think of them like baby steps towards your bigger dreams. Want to write a book? Start by setting a daily goal of writing 500 words. Want to invest in real estate? Start by researching properties for an hour each day. The act of setting and achieving small goals creates momentum. It gives you a sense of accomplishment and keeps you motivated to keep pushing forward. Plus, it just feels good to check things off your list, am I right? So grab a notebook, download a to-do list app, or just jot down your goals on a sticky note. Whatever works for you. The important thing is to be intentional about your day and make progress, one small goal at a time. All right, folks, let's talk about the power of reading. And no, I'm not just talking about scrolling through memes on Instagram. I'm talking about actually picking up a book, a physical book with pages and everything. Remember those? Reading is like a workout for your brain. It expands your knowledge, helps you think critically, and exposes you to new ideas and perspectives. Plus, it's a great way to relax and escape from the constant noise of everyday life. Now I know what you're thinking. Graham, I'm busy. 
when am I supposed to find time to read? But here's the thing, you don't need to dedicate hours every day to see the benefits. Even just 15 to 20 minutes before bed can make a difference. So ditch the doom scrolling and pick up a book instead. Whether it's a biography of a successful entrepreneur, a personal development book, or even just a good old fashioned novel, make reading a part of your daily routine. Trust me, your brain will thank you for it. And hey, if you enjoyed this tip, why not subscribe to the channel? I promise, it's way more beneficial than scrolling through cat videos. Well, most of the time. All right, let's talk mindfulness and meditation. I know, I know, you're picturing me sitting cross-legged on a mountaintop, chanting with a bunch of monks. But look, you don't have to become a Zen master to reap the benefits. Mindfulness is simply about being present in the moment. It's about turning down the volume on that constant mental chatter, you know, that voice in your head that's stressing about deadlines, bills, and whether or not you left the oven on. Meditation is like a workout for your brain. It helps you focus, reduce stress, and just generally feel more chill. And the best part, you can do it anywhere, anytime. No yoga pants required. There are tons of apps and guided meditations out there to get you started. Even just taking a few minutes each day to sit quietly and focus on your breath can make a world of difference. Trust me, your mind will thank you for it. Listen, I'm all about maximizing efficiency, and a solid morning routine is like having a cheat code for your day. It sets you up for success, plain and simple. We're not talking about just rolling out of bed five minutes before work and calling it a day. Think of it like this. How you start your morning sets the tone for everything that follows. A well-structured morning routine allows you to take control of your day before it even begins. Instead of rushing around like a headless chicken, you're calm, collected, and ready to tackle whatever comes your way. Now, everyone's ideal morning routine will look different, but the key is to find what works for you and stick to it. Maybe it's waking up early to exercise, meditate, or enjoy a quiet cup of coffee before the chaos begins. The point is to create a routine that energizes and prepares you for the day ahead. Remember, consistency is key here. Make it a habit, and you'll be amazed at the difference it makes. All right, let's talk about food, because who doesn't love a good meal? But seriously, the food you put into your body has a direct impact on your energy levels, your mood, and even your ability to focus. Think of it like this. Would you put cheap gas in a Ferrari? Probably not. So why treat your body any differently? Now, I'm not saying you have to become a health nut overnight and swear off pizza forever. Life's all about balance, right? But making small, sustainable changes to your diet can have a huge impact on your overall well-being. Start by incorporating more fruits, vegetables, and whole grains into your diet. These foods are packed with essential nutrients that your body needs to function at its best. And don't forget about protein. It keeps you feeling full and satisfied, which can help prevent those mid-afternoon snack attacks. Remember, healthy eating doesn't have to be boring or restrictive. There are endless possibilities for delicious and nutritious meals that will fuel your body and mind. Get creative in the kitchen, explore new recipes, and find what works for you. All right, let's talk about social media and screen time. We all know it can be a huge time suck, right? You pick up your phone to check the weather and suddenly, an hour's gone, and you're three years deep into your ex-co-worker's cousin's Instagram feed. What were you even doing? The thing is, constantly scrolling through social media can seriously mess with your productivity and your mental health. You're bombarded with everyone else's highlight reels, making you feel like you're not doing enough. It's like comparing your bloopers to everyone else's finished film. So, here's a radical idea. Put the phone down. I'm serious. Set some boundaries for yourself. Maybe designate specific times for social media or use apps that track and limit your usage. Your brain will thank you. Trust me, there's a whole world out there beyond the screen. Remember books, nature, actual human interaction. Rediscover those things. You might be surprised how much more fulfilling life can be when you're not glued to your phone. Now, let's talk about planning and prioritizing. Listen, our brains aren't supercomputers designed to remember every single appointment, deadline, and grocery list item. We've got enough going on up there already. That's why it's crucial to write things down. Get yourself a planner, a whiteboard, a stack of sticky notes, whatever works for you. When you visually organize your tasks and prioritize what needs to get done, you free up mental space for more important things. 
like deciding if you want to order takeout again tonight. Trust me, there's nothing more satisfying than physically crossing something off your list. It's like a little dopamine hit for your brain. Plus, having a plan helps you stay focused and avoid getting overwhelmed by the chaos of life. Remember, failing to plan is planning to fail. And in the wise words of Shia Labiouf, just do it. Get organized, make a plan, and watch your productivity skyrocket. Let's talk self-discipline. This is a big one, folks. It's the key to achieving your goals, whether it's building a successful business, investing wisely, or finally getting around to organizing your sock drawer. Think of self-discipline like a muscle. The more you exercise it, the stronger it gets. Every time you resist the urge to hit the snooze button, choose a salad over a burger, or stick to your budget instead of splurging on that unnecessary gadget, you're giving your self-discipline muscle a solid workout. Now, I'm not saying it's easy. There will be temptations, distractions, and moments where you just want to say screw it and binge watch Netflix in your pajamas. But trust me, the feeling of accomplishment you get from pushing through those moments is worth it. So, how do you build self-discipline? Start small, set realistic goals, and hold yourself accountable. Find an accountability partner, track your progress, and celebrate your wins, no matter how small. Remember, Rome wasn't built in a day, and neither is a rock-solid sense of self-discipline. All right, folks, let's talk about sleep. In our hustle culture, sleep is often seen as a luxury. People brag about running on fumes and pulling all-nighters, but it's not worth it. Getting seven to eight hours of sleep can be a game changer. You'll think clearer, have more energy, and be less grumpy. Studies show good sleep boosts productivity and memory. So, prioritize sleep. Trust me, your future self will thank you. Let's talk about something crucial for a fulfilling life relationships. Not just romantic ones, but friends, family, and mentors. You are the average of the five people you spend the most time with. Surround yourself with supportive, ambitious, and kind people. Their energy will rub off on you. They'll challenge you to be your best self and celebrate your wins. All right, let's talk about continuous learning. Now, I'm not saying you need to be hitting the books 24 slash seven, trying to become a rocket scientist overnight, but making a conscious effort to learn something new every single day. That's how you level up your life, my friends. Think about it. The more you learn, the more you know. The more you know, the more valuable you become. And the more valuable you become, well, let's just say your income has a funny way of reflecting that. It doesn't have to be complicated either. Read a book, listen to a podcast on your commute, take a course on something you've always been interested in, like real estate perhaps. The world is your oyster and knowledge is the pearl. So ditch the mindless scrolling and invest in yourself instead. Trust me, your future self will thank you. Now, this one might seem counterintuitive, especially in the world of finance. But trust me on this. Giving back is one of the most rewarding things you can do. And no, I'm not just talking about writing a big check to feel good about yourself. When I say give back, I mean genuinely helping others. Volunteer your time, donate to a cause you believe in, mentor someone just starting out. It's about making a real impact, however small it might seem. You know that warm, fuzzy feeling you get when you do something good for someone else? That's not just good karma, my friends. That's science. Helping others actually releases endorphins in the brain, making you feel happier and more fulfilled. Plus, you never know when you might need a little help yourself. It's all about paying it forward, creating a ripple effect of positivity. And who knows, maybe you'll inspire someone else to do the same. And there you have it. 15 powerful habits that can drastically change your life for the better. Remember, it's not about doing everything perfectly overnight. Start small, pick one or two habits that resonate with you and build from there. Thanks for watching Elite Minds. If you enjoyed this video, don't forget to like, share and subscribe. And hey, drop a comment below. We'd love to hear your thoughts on these habits. Until next time, keep striving for that luxury lifestyle.